Yo guys, what's up? So I'm back this week with another new video and today I'm going to show you guys how to do this everyday makeup look. So before we go into anything, make sure to subscribe so you know when I post a video every Friday and also share the video with your mom, your dad, your uncle, your neighbor, your neighbor's dogs, friends, cousin, whoever you think would maybe like this video even though you haven't seen it yet. So we won't know if you're going to like it. So, so yeah, let's just go right into it. All right, y'all. So we're going to start off with the tea tree water by Lush as a toner. After that, we're gonna go on with the Shine Control Oil Free Formula by XL. If you greasy as fuck like me, put that shit all over your face, but it's gonna burn real bad. Then use Makeup Forever um, Step One Skin Equalizer. Put that shit everywhere, all over your face, so you're not greasy all day. Then we're gonna go into Fenty Beauty. We're gonna use the shade 200 and put it all over my face. I only got a sample because I'm broke as hell and cannot afford the full thing. But we're gonna go in and put that everywhere. And make sure you blend that shit out with a big fat ass brush because we do not want to look like crap and we do not want to look blotchy. So just keep doing that and then if you got acne scars like me, you're going to want to do two coats. Get that shit covered. Make sure you blend your neck too so you don't look like you're from Jersey Shore and you got 10 different tan colors. And just make sure you blend that all over your face. Next, we're going to go with the NARS Concealer. I'm the color Light 2.5. Put it under your eyes, on your chin. And then we're going to put it on top of our forehead. Because we need to conceal shit. We don't want under eye bags. Like, what the fuck? And then we also need a bigger forehead because my forehead's small as fuck. So, yeah, we're going to do that right now. And I'm going to sing. And then we're going to blend that in. Really nice. Make a really ugly face so I'm gonna try to cover that just blend that shit in like blend it good like your life is depending on it then bring out that Anastasia Beverly Hills cream contour palette and then look for your brush but you can't find it so you're gonna look like an idiot oh and then once you find it just go along your cheekbones but I can't really find my cheekbones because I got a big fat ass face so it's kind of hard so I'm gonna try to make some of my own and then I'm going to go and contour my nose so I can be a skinny queen and make a little dick on my nose just so like skinny it out, you know? <laughs> and keep doing that. Then you're going to take your damp beauty blender and just like blend that shit in. Like just blend it in really nice. Okay, like beat your face. Okay. Then I'm going to go and use some bronzer. This could be any bronzer you got. And just put it right over your contour because it probably turned out like shit like mine did. This is why I don't contour my face. Okay, so yeah, just do that and then put it on your jawline because if you got 10 double chins like I do, you got to kind of make that shit look like it's not there. Okay, so I mean this kind of makes it look like you got a sharper jaw. Then go in, blend your nose, then go put your concealer up there and just kind of like rub it through the middle and stuff just so it's a little bit lighter than the contour and stuff. Next, we're going to go in, take any setting powder. I'm using Makeup Forever. Um, put it under your eyes and I wouldn't recommend using this at nighttime because there is a shit ton of flashback unless you want to like a uh, flashback Mary then go ahead and use it during the nighttime with the flash and I'm just gonna put it underneath um, by my chin all the way by my jawline on my forehead and shit wherever I get like greasy and stuff because we don't want to look greasy and I'm gonna put it by my nose and in the middle so I look like I just snorted a bunch of cocaine because that's the that's the look we're looking for the coke effect okay then I'm going to go on my forehead. I'm just going to brush the excess off so I don't look like a motherfucking ghost. Then I'm going to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Pomade in medium brown. And I'm going to use it for my eyebrows. I'm going to get the brush out, mix that shit. Then I'm going to start by lining the outside of my eyebrows. And then I'm going to slowly fill them in very lightly just so they look really, really natural. Because we in 2017, we're not about those black eyebrows, okay? So make sure you use the spool and blend that shit out. Because we ain't about that blocky eyebrow life, okay? So just make sure you keep blending that out so it looks pretty natural. And then make a little tail at the end like I am. So that shit can swim away. And then do the same shit with the other eyebrow. You want to make them look identical. Like I know people say, oh, eyebrows are supposed to look like sisters, not twins. Bitch, make those shits, make like make them look like my fucking twins, okay? Because they're probably not going to look alike to begin with. And then I'm using some concealer on top just so I can clean them up. And I'm also going to do some on the bottom. Because you want your shit to look really, really clean. You don't want 
bushy ass eyebrows, okay? You want them to look clean and tamed, okay? And then I'm gonna take my other brush and I'm just gonna blend it in because you don't want it to be a different color than the rest of your skin. Like, what are you doing? Just keep blending that shit in. Make sure you blend the bottom too. My pet peeve is like when makeup artists, they don't blend the bottom good. So, and then I'm gonna use the Anastasia um, clear brow gel to go over so my eyebrows stay in place because you don't want them shits going anywhere. You don't want anybody sponging your eyebrows or sweating them off or whatever, so this is going to keep them in place. Now I'm going to dust off the cocaine, and I'm just going to dust it off just so I look like a normal human being, so I don't look like a drug addict, you know? Dust that shit off good, and then I kind of like spread it all over my face just so I can set everything so I'm not all greasy and sweaty and so the shit stays in place. Make sure you get your neck too. Uh, using the plump and limb plumper, because if you got a non-existent top lip like me because I'm Caucasian. Use this shit. Put it everywhere. Okay. I want your money. More money. I want your money. More money. I want your money. I want more money. I want your money. Once upon a time not long ago, I was a hot. And I'm in it. I won't take it back because I did the shit. I was a hot. And I'm in it. I won't take it back because I did the shit. I was a hot. And that's just going to burn really bad. So you're going to cry about it later. And next we're gonna put um, some eye primer. I'm just using NYX, whatever primer you want. And like, just like blend that shit in. Just make it like nice and even on a base. Cause you need your eyeshadow to stay. Next I'm using the Urban Decay Naked Ultimate Basics Palette. And I'm just picking a really nude color, like something really subtle. Cause this is an everyday look that we can use every day, no matter where we're going. And then I'm using the Kat Von D Tattoo Liner in Trooper. And I first start making a wing, like just a motherfucking line, and then I just make another line, and I connect that shit, and I just keep going until it looks good, and then I just drag it along my top waterline, if that's what it's called, I don't know, and I just kind of do it until it looks good, I mean, I don't know, and I just keep doing that, and then I try to connect them, and I just try to like go along my eyelid, and do that so I mean there's your winged eyeliner tutorial that everyone wanted so there you go <laughs> and after that I'm gonna do my other eye and then I'm gonna use an eyelash curler curl my eyelashes because mine are fucking non-existent and I want them to kind of look like I have some then I'm using uh, Too Faced Better Than Sex waterproof mascara I use waterproof because I cry all the fucking time and just do one coat on your eyelashes because we're gonna put some um, fake lashes on so just do one coat on the top and then we're gonna go to the bottom and we're gonna do the bottom really lightly don't go fucking all out grunge on it just really lightly to bring them out then we're gonna use the duo eyelash glue and I use kiss lashes and number 11 just store bought shit cuz I'm poor so I use that and we're just gonna put it on the eyelash and then put that shit on there using tweezers cuz I mean like what else are you gonna use so just put it on there and try not to poke yourself in the eye and then we're gonna do the same thing with the other one and I mean yeah I'm, you gotta make the the fuck boy look you know the one that they use for their selfies you gotta make that look when you're doing it so make sure you get that look down cuz I got that look down so you gotta make sure you got it down okay and then I'm just gonna take out my um, Kylie Cosmetics lip liner in Candy K I'm gonna line that shit I'm gonna line my lips I'm gonna overline them actually because I got no top lip because I'm white. So I mean, slightly overline them just so they still look natural because we're gonna end up taking a uh, chapstick and blending that shit in. And it's supposed to look like you're not wearing any lipstick or anything. So natural full lip effect. So make sure you keep doing that. And then take a brush and just outline it and stuff. <laughs> Don't make your lips too big. And then I'm gonna go back over with my eyeliner just to cover up anything that the glue is showing. Just cover it up so it doesn't look like crap. Then I'm using the Fenty Beauty Duo Highlighter in Fire Crystal. Put that on your cheekbones so you glowing, bitch. Make sure you glowing, then put it on your nose. Because you wanna look like a motherfucking glazed donut, bitch. Then I'm gonna put it in the corner of my eye so I look like I'm kind of awake because I'm always half asleep. So, I mean, this is gonna help you look all bright and fresh. And then put it right underneath your eyebrows on the brow bone so it's popping in your pictures and shit. 
because trust me I don't really know why I do it but I mean it makes me look good so I do it then I'm gonna end with the Urban Decay D Slick setting spray put that shit everywhere so you're not greasy throughout the night and I mean that's about it so thank you for watching this tutorial I mean I'm just gonna kind of go over I mean I look really good I'm just gonna go over what I was saying make sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it make sure to subscribe so you know when I post every month fucking Friday and that's it so I'm gonna see you soon. Peace out.